Now it's my pleasure to introduce Bob Gabordi and Rebecca Lutz, formerly known as Rebecca Cantley, recently married, here from the Tallahassee Democrat to talk about the 10 ideas, things that could be new in Tallahassee if we made them happen. So Rebecca and Bob, are you here, Bob? Bob? Uh, oh, I guess Bob's not here, Rebecca, so. Um, good evening, everyone. Um, Bob is sorry he couldn't be here. We're working on a couple big projects at the newspaper, as we always are, and so he's busy with that tonight. Um, but we're talking about the future of Tallahassee, and at the Tallahassee Democrat, we have the special honor of telling the story of Tallahassee every day. And ten ideas that we think would be good for Tallahassee. Um, oh, are we already? Can I have a, in, a brief introduction? <laughs> Um, we were asked to do 10 ideas of, um, of what could happen in Tallahassee. Um, some of these things I kind of view as the building block for our community. Um, whatever we determine as our ultimate future, these are the things that really need to be in place. Um, and I inserted some humor in here. Healthy Tallahassee, a place where everyone has hot abs. I think this guy was one of the football players. Um, but for those of us who probably a six-pack is not going to be realistic, myself included, <laughs> um, a city whose residents eat well, exercise, and encourage, encourage balance for mind and body. And that's something that really goes along with what the city is trying to do with the 95210 campaign. I'm um, really making Tallahassee a place where residents focus on being healthy. A smart Tallahassee. We are education in Tallahassee. We know um, our readers at the Democrat, one of the number one things that they look to us for, because they've told us this time and again in surveys, is that they want to know how their um, school system is doing and how funding of education is. And so for Tallahassee, we really want to see a place where students of all ages feel empowered and can achieve their best. A green Tallahassee. Do we not live in one of the most beautiful places in the world? I have lived in beautiful places. I have lived in um, the Blue Ridge Mountains. I've lived in the mountains in West Virginia. And Tallahassee is just right up there. And so a community whose residents value and protect their unique and natural resources. Connected Tallahassee, of course, through Tallahassee Democrat products. Um, but... Uh, Tallahassee, we really need to stay connected to each other, um, to the issues and goals that are important to us as a community, and all of us staying informed. Fun Tallahassee. We like a good party, don't we? Springtime Tallahassee. Um, and I think a lot of this goes into uh, what the folks from uh, Cascades Park, Park were mentioning, a place where everyone enjoys a good party. We all enjoy coming together, celebrating who we are, and celebrating this town where we choose to live. Caring Tallahassee, one of my most favorite things about Tallahassee. Um, our network of volunteer organizations here is strong and can be even stronger. Um, we should be a place where community members solve collective problems and care for each other through a strong network of volunteers. Nurturing Tallahassee. Um, this is a place of strong families. Uh, again, something our readers have told us through surveys is one of the things that they value most in, um, in Tallahassee is keeping Tallahassee a special place for my family. Um, so we should be a place where residents value families and the development of all children as priority. And a winning Tallahassee. Can I get a seminal chop? <laughs> really, we just won another champ national championship. Please. And if you're a Gator, I'm sorry, but you live in Tallahassee, so you just kind of have to accept this as your lot in life. <laughs> Moving Tallahassee, a commitment to an overall transportation plan that includes diverse, convenient options. Um, we are seeing this expand here in Tallahassee, and would like to see it expand even more so that we would all have options for the various uh, transportation that we find the most convenient and, uh, and unique to our lifestyle and a working Tallahassee, of course. Employment and training op options for workers and professionals with various skill sets. And finally, and Bob isn't here, um, so somebody mentioned um, the, the dog park. This is Bob's dog, Hazel, whom he writes about very often, and this is my pug, Lulu. In the future, Hazel and Lulu would like to have their own city park downtown, so if the folks in Cascades could make a note of that. That'd be great. <laughs> Thank you.